Welcome to ABC Interactive English. I'm Brandon. I'm Kim. And welcome. We're going to be talking about.、Uh, <coughs> what are you doing? We have to get started. I'm reading some of my favorite fairy tales. Have you heard of them? Cinderella, Hansel and Gretel. Yeah, all these kinds. Yeah, I love Hansel and Gretel. Actually, Hansel and Gretel—that's the one where the boy and the girl, the brother and sister, they go into the forest and they meet a witch. Yeah, she's really scary. She tries to eat them. Oh, yeah, yeah she's really bad. But、uh, I don't really like that story because、huh? it's got the bad witch. I, I, do you know any stories about、uh, someone in the forest who's good? I do, and in fact, we're going to talk about that today. This is Saint Joseph in the Forest, Part One. All right. <laughs> There was once a mother with three daughters. The first was mean, the second was fair, and the last was good. The mother loved the first, but she didn't like the last. Okay, so let me get this straight. Saint Joseph is in the forest for this story. Is that right? What's he doing in there? I don't know what he's doing. Let's find out. All right. Well, our story begins. There was once a mother with three daughters. Whoa! Simple enough. Three daughters. Yeah. That's the same as my mother. Oh, really? I have three sisters. Are you the only boy? No, I also have an older brother.、Oh, They're、okay. all older than me.、Uh, so that means my mother also has. Three daughters. Ah, so any female child that you have would be your daughter. Yeah, girl children are daughters.、Uh, you are a daughter, right? Yes, but I'm my parents' only daughter. I'm an only child too. I、oh. have no brothers or sisters. Wow, and I have a lot. I know we're like opposite. <laughs> <laughs> you have so many. Okay, so once, once they said there once was a woman. There once was a woman. Now. I know that once means one time. Yes, but that's not what it means here, right? Right. So here we see it says there once was a woman, and we start out a lot of stories with this to kind of set the time and the place. Once upon a time, for example,、oh, yeah. we know that this is a story, and it's kind of a literary way to start out telling a story. So、mm. there once was a man. And he lived in the woods, and his name was Saint Joseph.、Hmm. Could、and、be another way to start this story. There once was a woman, and three children of hers were daughters. Okay, so once,、uh, one time, or beginning a story. Yes. All right, I get it. So, the first was mean, the second was fair, and the last was good. The mother loved the first. But she didn't like the last. Okay, that's talking about the daughters. Right. So she likes her first daughter, loves her first daughter. She doesn't like the last one, and she feels nothing about the middle one. Yeah, we don't know how she feels about the middle child. The middle one is just there. <laughs> maybe she's happy. Maybe she's sad about her. But she has three children, and she loves the first, but she doesn't. Love the last, B- but what did it say about them? How how did they feel? The first child, the first daughter, is mean. So why does she love the first daughter? The first daughter is mean. Huh? I don't know. So when you're mean, you're somebody who likes making other people upset, or you're very bad to other people. Yeah. So yeah. she likes this very mean girl who maybe does things to annoy her sisters, or says bad things to her mother, or treats other people badly. She's a mean person. Yeah, but the middle daughter is fair, and fair has a lot of meanings. One of the meanings means pretty, but I don't think this story means pretty. No, I'm pretty sure. Fair in this story for the second daughter, the middle daughter, it means that she's not mean, but she's also not nice. She doesn't help people, but she doesn't hurt people. 
she's kind of in the middle. Yeah, so she's not good, she's not bad, she's just there. Yeah, she's the middle child, and she's kind of middle of the road. I think some middle children are like that, right? They have the older sister, brother, and the younger sister, brother, and they kind of have to compete. You know, yeah. you're a big family, huh? Yeah, I have a big family, a lot of competition. But the last daughter, she was nice. Good. She's good. So why doesn't the mother like her? Yeah, you'd think that the daughter would uh, be good and the mother would love her for that, but the mother loves the mean daughter. Maybe huh. the mother is also mean. You know, that's probably right. Yeah. Uh -huh. So we will yeah. find out after our break uh, exactly what's going on with this mom and her three daughters. So and stay tuned. why she's mean. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, the mother didn't want the last daughter. So she sent her into the forest. The girl walked and walked. After some time, she found a little hut and knocked on the door. An old man opened the door. He was Saint Joseph. When he saw the little girl, he told her to enter. All right, we're back. We're talking about this mom and her three daughters. One is mean, yeah. one is fair, mm -hmm. and the last one is good. But the mother loves the mean daughter, the first daughter. For some reason that we're not quite sure of. Yeah. But because it's a story, we're not going to ask too many questions. No. Okay. As we read, in fact, the mother didn't want the last daughter. This is the good one. Didn't want the last daughter. That's very mean. So this mother is definitely mean. Definitely. Yeah, wow. I can't imagine a mother not wanting a daughter. That's so mean. Especially if she's good. Yeah. Huh. Oh, that's just weird. Well, that's the story. Uh, but that daughter is the last daughter. Okay, so the last daughter. How can we use last in a sentence? So, I went to the store today and I got the last candy bar. Ooh, nice. Oh, I ran a race. I was running a race, but I'm not very fast. So, I was the last to arrive ah. at the finish line. You were the last? Yeah, but there was only two people, so. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's me or the other person. Okay, that works out then. Not too bad. So as we <laughs> see, last can be an adjective to describe something, like I got the last candy bar, which describes that this one is the only one left. Yeah. Or, as Brandon used it, like a noun. You can talk about this is the last thing. Mm, exactly. So, she sent her into the forest. The girl walked and walked. After some time, she found a little hut and knocked on the door. Oh, don't knock on the door of strange huts in the forest. I don't know. If That's like rule number one. But if you're lost in the forest and you're a little girl, you might be happy to see a house. I'd be mad at my mom. Well, I'd definitely be mad Into at the my forest. mom. Yeah. Why? Not fair. Not fair of the mother. Well, she's going to knock on this little door. I wonder who's inside. I don't know, but it's a hut. Now, a hut is kind of like a house, right? Yeah, it's like a really small little house. Maybe one that you built yourself. So it mm. might be made out of trees and maybe bricks you made yourself. And it's really, really small. Yeah. It's not like a cabin where you might go to stay in the forest, and that's quite big and nicely made. This is something that you just threw together and you created out of nothing, really. Yeah, just a hut in the forest, as you mentioned. He lives in the forest. Uh, the forest is the place with a lot of trees. If you go into the forest, uh, you'll see many, many trees and rocks and maybe a small stream or river. Yeah, and there's going to be lots of animals. Mm -hmm. And one of the most famous forests that I can think of in the U.S. is Yosemite. 
National oh, yeah, Park yeah. is a very huge, huge forest. I think there's a big forest in Kunding in Taiwan, oh, really? in the south, which is also a national park, and Yangmingshan is also mm, a mm, big mm. forest. These are just areas with lots of trees, lots of wild animals, and no people. Do you like to go hiking in the forest? I do. I like it a lot. Do yeah. you? Me too. I actually grew up going camping a lot. Oh, really? So I've been in the forest many, many times. It's like my second home. <laughs> That's really cool. I like going in the forest. It's very peaceful. Mm, I agree. Yeah. They say if you go to the forest, it calms people down. I would agree with that, but yeah. I've never been in the forest and seen any huts and decided to knock on the hut's door. But maybe that's why this person lives out in the forest. Ah. It makes them feel calm. So who is there? Let's, Let's find, find out. out. <laughs> hmm, it says an old man opened the door. Hmm. He was St. Joseph. When he saw the little girl, he told her to enter. No, now she's going in a strange old man's house. Little girl. Little girl, no. Well, I don't know. He's maybe a really good person. But does she know he's St. Joseph? I don't know. Hmm. But if you look like a really good person, maybe you are. And she might also really need help. True. He opens the door. He sees this poor little girl. She's obviously been walking around for a while, so he, of course, wants to help her. Yeah, and St. Joseph, we know he's a really nice guy in history and uh, through stories. We know St. Joseph is a good person, so I'm pretty sure the little girl will be just fine. We will see in the next part, so stay tuned and we will be back. There was once a mother with three daughters. The first was mean, the second was fair, and the last was good. The mother loved the first, but she didn't like the last. In fact, the mother didn't want the last daughter, so she sent her into the forest. The girl walked and walked. After some time, she found a little hut and knocked on the door. An old man opened the door. He was Saint Joseph. When he saw the little girl, he told her to enter. Hello, 第一个呢是 in fact， 就是事实上。这个副词片语呢，通常放在句首。我们要记得在书写的时候 ，in fact 的后面必须加逗号再接句子。它可以修饰句子，功能是补充说明。那我们知道 actually 也是其实，它和 in fact 都是副词，所以差别在哪里呢？它们的不同就在 in fact 只能修饰句子。而 actually 除了修饰句子，也可以修饰动词跟形容词等等。那我们一起看一个例句 ：Warren lacks experience. In fact, he's too young for the job. 第二个 ，A sends B into place. A 把 B 送到某处。Sent 的三态呢是 send, sent, sent， 也就是送到派遣的意思。比如说 ，The fire department sends more firefighters into the building to see if there's anybody left. 消防局派了更多消防员进入大楼，看是否还有人留在里面。第三个 ，Knock on the door， 敲门。Knock on 呢，就是指敲或是击的意思。例如 ，The secretary knocks on the door before going into the office. 秘书在进入办公室之前敲门。我们一起看四个单字。第一个是 once， 从前曾经，它可以作为副词。This place was once a flourishing city for trade。这个地方曾经是一个繁荣的贸易城市。第二个 daughter， 名词，女儿。Kate weeps with joy at her daughter's wedding。Kate 在女儿的婚礼上喜极而泣。第三个 mean。形容词，心肠坏的。Cinderella has a mean stepmother who treats her unfairly. 灰姑娘有一个心肠坏的继母，对她不公平。第四个 ，last， 它可以作为名词，也可以作为形容词。最后一个，最后的意思。
第一个作为名词的时候，你可以说 I've had one chocolate and you can have the last. 我已经有吃巧克力了，你可以吃最后一个。那作为形容词的时候，你可以说 Amanda was the last one to leave the office yesterday. Amanda 是昨天最后一个离开办公室的人。Hi, I'm Matt. And today we're going to play word drop. We each have three vocab words that we're going to work casually into our conversation. So let's get started. So this past year, I've really missed traveling.、Uh, it's been a really long time since I traveled abroad.、Um, I still have a lot of good pictures and stuff from my last trip abroad, which was to Thailand. Your last trip abroad to Thailand.、Mm -hmm. Okay, that's nice. I used to、um, go on trips a lot growing up with my two parents, my mom and my dad, and me, and and their other daughter, which is my sister. <laughs> we would、uh, go on road trips sometimes. Sometimes we'd go to Europe or just you know go go visit all types of places, and it was a lot of a lot of fun. Really good memories growing up with me and their other daughter. That's great. I have a lot of good memories with、uh, with my family traveling too, and、uh, I remember sometimes.、Uh, well, one time we went to Italy with my my parents and my sister, and it was mostly really fun. But sometimes,、uh, sometimes my sister, sometimes my sister would was not nice to me. She was sometimes a mean sister. Okay, like an evil stepsister. Yeah, sometimes. Okay. Yeah, I went to Italy once as well, and I found that actually the I liked the islands on the coast better, like like the Amalfi Coast. I think they're more interesting than Italy. I mean, than like the like the 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 boot-shaped peninsula itself. If you if you、uh, got a chance to visit those places, do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah,、okay. I do. Yeah, I've uh, I've uh, yeah, I think、uh, I didn't actually get a chance to go to those islands. But、uh, we were near the Amalfi Coast, and、uh, yeah, I really enjoyed it. In in fact, it's one of my favorite trips I've been on. Really? Okay. Hold on. Did someone just knock on the door? I think someone did. I think I think it's my time to. I think I need to go. See you later. Okay. See you next time.